Sicilian defense is by far the uh, biggest chapter in modern chess theory. In chess theory, in Sicilian defense is the biggest and richest opening uh, there is. Um, that's why the theory, modern theory about the uh, Sicilian is developing for many decades and it's developing on daily basis. Well, that's why I recommended a um, little more unique continuation uh, is Grand Prix. Well, this is a lot shorter way than uh, most popular variations, but even here, we see updates and if we invented some idea you, my, our opponent comes up always with some interesting different respond and i'm gonna tell you this will never end this just proves that opening is sound and we keep playing getting good positions our opponent is uh, uh, fighting back and we learn about more and more interesting positions. I already covered this more than once, this opening, but I want to attract your attention in on some specific sub, uh, variations of the Grand Prix. Well, for example, e4, c5, knight, c3, knight, c6, f4, e6, this is one of the continuations, knight, f3, d5, and bishop to b5. Okay, there is 97 move that we uh, covered entirely, and there not have been too many updates on this. White, my final opinion about knight is that white has very good positions. Same about knight f6. I have not seen black coming up with uh, good enough response to equalize. However, black played de in um, several games. Now let me explain why would they play de. When we play bishop b5, there is no way black can prevent doubling the c pawn, uh, the uh, pawns on c file. And that goes for knight e7 move as well, because as you know, we take on d5 and go queen e2 with the same idea taking on c6. You have to know the basic ideas of this opening so well. That's why you will know why is it important to double the c pawns and make c5 pawn a target. So black played, black plays here de with an idea the idea is if white takes on his e4, then can go, they can go knight e7 or even bishop d7. Uh, uh, you should notice that bishop d7 right away just loses a pawn. So after de, we take on c6, pawn takes on c6 and this happened in my game and now I take on e4. Here is the danger of this position for black. If white goes d3 and b3, those pawns gonna be very weak and black is gonna have a strategically lost position. But I play this against uh, good enough players, they know they cannot let white play b3 d3 and so in this position they played c4. Now this happened 
in my students game it happened in many other games and black seems to be getting a good position so we have a dilemma what to do with it and I have tried b3 and black have played bishop a6 and black was okay and then I made an improvement and I was waiting for the next player to go c4 and I had it not too long ago pretty strong player he played c4 immediately in this position now this is a bad move it's a good idea but bad move the refutation to this move is queen to e2 attacking c4 pawn of course we are not going to win this pawn because that's what black wants to do anyway bishop a6 and they they want to restrict white from playing d3 or b3 but then the key move is f5 and you see how f5 can change all evaluation about this this position and this can now black really has serious problems what can they do after f5 uh, obviously e takes f is out of question because there is a checkmate in one move uh, but letting white take on e6 and retake back with a pawn also looks very bad because all pawns are very weak knight eg5 is coming and black is practically lost so move that was made by black was queen to d7 f takes e queen takes e6 and now we can go knight to d4 and uh, we see that black is totally lost queen has to move queen cannot leave the e-file uh, because then will be discovered check with the e knight will be devastating and after queen e5 or queen e7 we're gonna have simply queen takes c6 and we continue grabbing material having initiative and game is practically decided so that was an interesting and very simple innovation that was missed by wife for quite some time and now we concluded that after c4 queen e2 black simply has well mildly said uh, at a very bad position because pawn on c4 is lost and game is practically lost so this is one interesting addition in our grand prix